In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, the Lord be with you. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. Glory to you, Lord. When Jesus saw the crowds, he went up the mountain, and after he had sat down, his disciples came to him. He began to teach them, saying, Blessed are the poor in spirit, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. Blessed are they who mourn, for they will be comforted. Blessed are the meek, for they will inherit the land. Blessed are they who hunger and thirst for righteousness, for they will be satisfied. Blessed are the merciful, for they will be shown mercy. Blessed are the clean of heart, for they will see God. Blessed are the peacemakers, for they will be called children of God. Blessed are they who are persecuted for the sake of righteousness, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. Blessed are you when they insult you and persecute you, and utter every kind of evil against you falsely because of me. Rejoice and be glad, for your reward will be great in heaven. Thus they persecuted the prophets who were before you. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Jesus speaks about the Beatitudes in the readings today. Uh, the Beatitudes are completely contrary to the ways of the world. And as we know, um, and these are the people, these are the qualities that, that are pleasing to God. They will be blessed by God. They will be favored by God. God will be with them to support them and to help them. And these also are the qualities of Jesus himself. And, uh, and so let's just kind of, kind of go over them um, so we can have a better understanding of what these qualities are that Jesus speak of, uh, speaks about. Blessed are the poor in spirit. These are the people who are humble. They know they have nothing to call their own. And this, so they rely on God for everything. And um, blessed are they are those who mourn. And these are the people who are suffering. They are, they are suffering. And God is close to those who are suffering. But another <clears throat> meaning here is that those who are mourning for their sins. Um, we realize our sins. We see the evil around us. And we mourn because, because of God's goodness. And this is how we repay God with evil and sin. And so we, the, there's contrition, there's sadness, there's sorrows for our sins. And blessed are the meek. These are people who are gentle. They don't respond with aggression or hostility or anger, but they are, they are gentle and they exercise self-control. Again, they rely on God to set things right. They try, they try to do what they can, but they, 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 are, they are very gentle about it. Um, blessed are they, are they who hunger and thirst for righteousness. And, these, and, and God is righteous, so they, these are people who thirst for God's will, that God's will be done in their life. We search, we, they search for, they, they, they hunger and thirst for what is good, what is right, what, what is pleasing to God. Blessed are the merciful. So, uh, so these are, this is the quality of God himself. He is merciful. So to be merciful is to be able to empathize with others and to be generous with others and, and to forgive others. Blessed are the peace, uh, blessed are the clean of heart, for they will see God. So the clean of heart here is purity, uh, but also the, um, <clears throat> to love God, uh, to, go, to love God purely, to love God wholly, uh, not, not, not loving the things of the world or anything else, not loving ourselves, but, but really uh, to have this pure love of God. And blessed are the peacemakers, those who want to cultivate peace and reconciliation between us and God and, and between ourselves, rather than division and, and, uh, and, um, and divisiveness. And then blessed are those uh, who are persecuted for the sake of righteousness, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. So if we are true to God, we will be persecuted. Um, we will be labeled all kinds of things, haters and all kinds of things. Um, but, and then, but Jesus said, you know, blessed are you when they insult you and persecute you and utter every kind of evil against you falsely because of me. Rejoice and be glad, for your reward will be great in heaven. So those who are true to Jesus and true to the teachings of his church, of course, we will be persecuted. But our reward will start now and will, will, be, uh, um, will be full um, and will be perfect in heaven. So these are the qualities. Of, of Jesus himself. These are the qualities that every Christian should have. Meek, humble, peacemaker, pure of heart, uh, mourning for our sins, and uh, forgiving others, and, and, and so on. So let us pray. We thank you, Jesus, for teaching us the Beatitudes, that these are your qualities, and these are the qualities that are pleasing to you, and help us to be close to you, and knowing that God 
will, will bless us now and in the life to come. May Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit.